Hey guys, it's Ben here. Uh, I just got a Electrac E15 lawn tractor this week. It was in pretty good condition, but I did notice uh, the one of the motors was binding up. So this is one of the three uh, motors off the mower deck. Um, it's got four uh, bolts here that hold it to the mower deck. And then uh, the blade goes right on here. So I took the blade off, I took those bolts off, I got it out of the mower deck. And then it has kind of a cap, which it only had one screw. It was missing the other. You pop that cap off. And then underneath there is your uh, power connections. So two wires uh, went to the power connections on there. And then once that's off, there's a, a nut that goes on here. And unfortunately on the other side, right there, it was broken off. So... Looks like maybe somebody pulled this off once and didn't do a very good job with it. But if I pull this off, this is the commutator end. Come on. Gosh darn it, came off easier before. <laughs> Hang on. So down on this end, you can see a bearing that holds the end of the, uh, uh, the rotor. And uh, here's our brushes. It's two of them. Uh, they look maybe short, but in uh, pretty good condition otherwise. And then back in here is uh, some washers and one of those little wiggly round springs that kind of holds everything together. Um, but if we try to look inside, it's going to be a little dark, but we'll take a look. Um, there's these the two rods that hold the end cap on. The one was broken short. It looks like there's maybe just a little bit of damage to the magnets here. So this uh, rotor was kind of um, bouncing around in there. It wasn't really spinning quite the way it was supposed to. And because, you know, that bearing right there looks like it's fine. I think the uh, issue is somewhere down on a... Focus, please. Focus. Thank you. I think is down on this end somewhere. However, uh, this part's aluminum. Uh, that shaft there is steel. And then this is aluminum, or if not aluminum... Uh, I know, some similar non-metallic metal, or a non-ferrous metal. Um, so what I need to do is get a puller so that I can yank this off, and then I should be able to... It looks like kind of the shell of the motor here and this big ring that holds it into the mower are um, two separate pieces, as best I can tell, although I'm not sure how to get them apart. So maybe uh, somebody who's worked on Electrax quite a bit before could weigh in on that and uh, let me know um, how to get this thing the rest of the way apart. But then uh, when I do, I should be able... Oh, because I forgot to mention, there's two screws, two little screws, down on this end. I took them out, but I uh, wasn't quite sure exactly what those were connecting to, but somehow that seems to hold this whole thing together. Also, back in with one of the magnets there, I did find this, a little jagged, bent piece of metal. I'm not sure what that was from, but uh, some sort of a washer or bushing or something that uh, broke loose in there and that may have been part of the problem. But uh, anyways, hopefully I can get this thing apart and then it um, uh, should be a pretty simple matter to rebuild and get the mower up and running. 